I was trying to be a novelist, not trying to be a professional musician, so everything's happening at once. I'm in the thick of it, and I'm so blessed and grateful. My name is Ilana Katz Katz, and I am from Boston, Massachusetts. I trained me. I went to a, a wonderful fiddle camp to learn Appalachian music, which kind of worked on my ear called um, Ashokan. And I've been listening to blues, and, my, and Ronnie Earl took me under his wing about five years ago. He was on my first record. But I've been playing in the subway for this my 11th year. I play in blues festivals all over the place now in, in Memphis and a bunch of festivals, but I still love to play in the subway quite a bit. And I play around Boston. And, lucky there aren't a lot of people doing what I'm doing, but I, I sure love it. The blues fiddle is, actually came before the guitar. People say, oh, that's interesting. And I'm like, no, it's actually really, really old. So one thing that makes it kind of sound cool is because the violin has sustenance because you're holding the notes. That's what makes it sound nice with so many instruments like the guitar and other things where you have the plucking going on. The community is wonderful. There's a great uh, organization called National Women in Blues, and I just played on their showcase in Memphis in January. I was a featured performer. I had Robert Kimbrough back in me. First of all, I love getting to do all that I do. I also sing and do my own solo music, but Clarksdale, I mean, this is where it all began. This is a very special place. You feel it in the air. I mean, it feels different than Memphis. It feels different than it's got its own vibe. You, first time I came here was just a few years ago. You just feel the spirits of the blues musicians who have been here and feel it here. Very soulful, that's what came to me.